Hello and welcome to this presentation from Alexander Gert from Hamamatsu, who's going to give us a presentation on trust in your laser sintering process. Um, as always, please leave your questions for Alexander in the sidebar and I'll come back at the end of the uh, talk to take any questions you may have. Over to you, Alexander. Thank you, Chris, for giving us the opportunity to present our topic here. I want to talk about laser sintering process. Um, my talk is separated in two parts. So at first I want to introduce you the Hamamatsu laser system, which is suitable for the laser sintering process of printed electronics. And in the second part, I want to show you some results of our, yeah, of our cooperation with a um, ink manufacturer and um, yeah, to show you the, the good benefits of the laser sintering process, which is pretty yeah new process in this um, print electronics world. But at first, um, as a yeah pretty newcomer in this TechPlic network, I want to uh, introduce you Hamatsu Photonics um, very quickly. So we are a Japanese company established in the 1950s. Um, headquarter is um, yeah it's placed in the city Hamatsu, um, which is close to Tokyo, and um, yeah it's a very good reachable with the Shinkansen fast train. And we are a company with more than 5,000 employees and a global player in the photonics market, and especially for the um, component sector, we are well known for our customization. And we also won, or not we won, but our customers won three Nobel Prizes with, um, yeah, Hamamatsu products um, inside. Um, there was the, the Kamio Kande, Super Kamio Kande project for neutrino detection and the, um, the Higgs boson detection with the um, CERN at the LLC. LRC. So it was a um, great success. And um, yeah. The product portfolio is very huge with over 15,000 products. So it makes also sometimes the life of the sales engineer difficult, <laughs> frankly speaking. But um, this is also very interesting for us to have such a wide um, variety of products. And it's, yeah, very, very close to the customer. And it's um, nice to see all this application. Just a short snapshot of our products. On the left, you can see um, yeah, some of our tube products where Hamatsu came from, the photomultipliers and so on. Um, here on the right side, the right bottom side, you can see some of our semiconductor products um, and as well our laser products. For example, here are some components, um, quantum cascade lasers and so on. Um, on, the, yeah, on the right side, on the um, top, you can see some modules which we um, manufacture by our own with our own components and um, one step ahead um, we also manufacture a camera system with own electronics and own components from our um, yeah from our solid state division um, where these semiconductor products came from and these are um, of our four divisions um, which makes um, this huge variety of products and um, yeah that's basically our product portfolio in um, a short term explained. But jumping into a presentation, um, yeah, we want to talk about lasers at first. And as you can see here, this is our laser, which we want to introduce you at first. Um, it's called SPOLT. Um, SPOLT stands for Spotlight Laser Diode. And I want to introduce you the rough specification. So it's a um, CW laser, so continuous wave. Um, we offer two wavelengths um, for 808 nanometers and 940 nanometers. As you can see, this type and all the types are fiber coupled. So you have the laser unit here and the laser irradiation unit with the fiber, which is very flexible. Um, uh, yeah, with the five meter fiber, you can place it into your machine and far away from the system. So it gives you a lot of flexibility and we offer a um, uh, power range, um, a maximum power range from 10 watts to 360 watts. It really depends on the application, what you need. Of course, there's a price difference on the, the um, smaller units. Um, and this um, power gives you more um, yeah, flexibility, of course. And um, this is also totally enough power for the sintering process. And we are also aiming at long lifetime, which